What's going on YouTube Metal Complex here and welcome to another short little unboxing with YouTube's greatest and most efficient knife unboxer. This uh, this box I believe was sent to me by the Passeron group which means whatever was in it or whatever is in it uh, was provided to us by the manufacturer. So without further ado let's go ahead and get into it here. What a perfect opportunity to use my brand new uh, Maximate Spyderco Para 3. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. We have rules on this channel. We um we are bound by the Lady of the Sea, or at least I am. So let's go ahead and cut into the sides here and make two precision cuts with the coveted CPM Rainbow Steel, that which has maximum edge retention and therefore maximum cutting ability with no regard to science or any anything that goes into metallurgy. Uh, let's go ahead and get the, oh boy, okay, we've got a Bestec knife. You guys know, who have been watching for a while, how much I love Bestec. Let's get in here. Now, wait a sec. Let me see who this came from. Did this come from the past? I, I can't remember if this came, I, I think it did. What do we have? Mm, wow, wait a minute, wait a minute here. What do we have here? I have never seen, so, okay. This is a titanium frame lock that is obviously from Bestex premium line. We've got a nice forward finger choil. We've got a blade stock thickness of probably 145 thousandths. Two-tone, sort of acid washed, or very dark tumbling with some satin flats, S35VN. Uh, we have a very dark bronze tumbled frame. Looks like a very interesting pivot with a nice um, lighter anodized uh, pivot collar. Very, very interesting. I, I'm a big fan of Bestec because they seem to get their designs pretty straightforward um, and uh, utilitarian, but at the same time, they add some cool flair. Um, so this is, right off the bat, I mean, this is a, an extremely interesting knife to me. It looks like Bestec has once again created a model that at least agrees with my hands. Um, and is visually appealing on first impression. So that is an interesting knife. Can't wait to play with that for a little bit and give my thoughts on it. That's gonna be pretty much it for today's short little unboxing. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do of course have lots of videos of knives that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like. So check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, then please subscribe to my channel because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching and have a great day.